Andy. Hey, How are you doing, mate? You all right? Yeah, good, you? Yeah, not too bad. How's things? Good, good stuff, good, good stuff. Oh, wow. Show me, man. What's going down? I'm a sucker for oversized tees. Yeah. So <laughs> this is, I mean, for me, a, a guy that's not as tall yeah. makes oversized look even better. Because yeah, when, you, when, you su when you're super tall, it, yeah. it kind of just like wrong. a normal yeah. fit of tee. <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, this, this tee on me would like, I mean, with, for the height that I am, and obviously I've got like baggy trousers. Yeah, it totally. just suits my vibe. So absolutely, like Margella nailed that. You wouldn't normally see me in this, but I mean... Do you wear knitwear? Uh, I do and I don't. It's probably like when I'm feeling a little bit bougie, to be quite frank. Like when I, when I, when I feel like I want to style it up, and obviously yeah, yeah, yeah. we're in we're in the winter season now. Like I mean, I, I could definitely I could definitely rock that. So nice. um, yeah, I've fallen in love with that real quick. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just looking to you know keep building on um, my wardrobe and just keep adding pieces to. It. Yeah. We we're yeah. always trying to find that next brand, or it takes a celebrity to obviously yeah. say, all right, they've put this brand on. Yeah. How do you guys know and dictate in terms of you know have you ever had to look at a brand and think? We'll take a punt on it, we'll take a risk yeah, yeah, on it, and then so see whether or not yeah. it would risk uh, that's, working or that's not. That's all, my, all my colleagues are kind of, we send all night Instagram, we send each of the links to whatever we like. Yeah. And then you'll get kind of a hint. And there's a few people in the industry who kind of, you can literally take as influencers. And if they're wearing something early, it's then you kind of think that they need to take a look at that. We often go to multi brand showrooms who will have probably maybe five, six, seven brands that are up and coming. You kind of then see something you think, actually, that's got a chance will fly out and you kind of hit the ground running, you've got to go straight out to your first appointments. You've got to be pretty switched on, you've got to go make sure you know kind of clear which brand you're seeing, that you get the, the idea of what story they're trying to tell and what we're trying to tell and hope that, that that combines nicely. Then you'll pick your collection from a showroom that's probably, you know, a lot of pieces. You'll whittle down by using a just, just converting each other and saying actually we can think it's a little better than What we should do in the future is probably work together. Go out to Paris together, and then you can do some shows. You can see yeah. how we work, show what our day to day life is like yeah. in the industry. So that'd be good. Yeah, absolutely. I look forward to that, man. That'd be sick. Definitely. Love that.